Hey, what's going on, everybody? Scudder Gaming here. Thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we're back for the last episode of the season of Football Manager 2017. Uh, four games left to go. Three points behind the leaders, a game in hand with a insufficient goal difference to them. Uh, a couple of things have happened between episodes. First off, um, Newmarket won by seven goals to one in their last game, which puts them three points in front and gives them ten goals advantage in the goal difference uh, category. Um, and Nelson has left. One of our best players this season um, has gone to Kings Lynn. So we're we're down a, our usual midfielder. Um, we're going to play our, I guess, our first choice team, although there's a question around Palmer or Youngs up top. Um, now that means Hall moves into midfield. Uh, the, the only question, I guess, is around Bennett and whether he should be playing. There's also a bid in for him, uh, but we're gonna we're gonna go with this one, I think, and just see how we get on. And we need to win every single game and hope that Newmarket slip up. Whether that happens or not is a very very odd question. I don't think they will. I think we're. I think we're destined to another year in this league but let's see how we get on we all we can do is is perform and win and see how see what happens and you know it could be that if we win all the games we go up but there could also be the very strong possibility based on how well we've been playing that we don't win all the games so um who knows Okay, 40 minutes gone, we've done absolutely nothing. What also happened is they postponed our game for three days, uh, this game that we're due to be playing. So now we've got a little bit of a compression with our fixtures, which isn't good, because we're not going to have the fitness to to do it, to, to perform and to play. So that could come back and really hinder us as well. But also, since we haven't created a single chance, we've got problems. We've got big problems right now. Ooh. Okay. I need something here, lads. Otherwise, these last four games are really going to be a bit of a damp squid if we can't um, squib if we can't get anything out of the sim simple game, the first game that we're playing. Um, done nothing so far. Palmer's in. Someone please create a single chance. Is this it? Is this the one? King finds Howard. Holding on to the ball without really creating anything. There we go. Oh no, I think that could be our, our issue here. We've missed again. Last game we missed about seven or eight clear-cut chances. This time we've only created the one, but we missed it. O'Sullivan, Sambu, Martin, Hoare, O'Sullivan, Hoare again. King puts it wide. Dear, oh dear. Our shooting boots have deserted us right now. At our absolute time of need. There's Howard again. O'Sullivan. Penalty. Seven minutes to go and we've got a penalty. No pressure, Howard. Oh dear. His pet last two penalties have been spectacular. But whether this one will be or not, I don't know. Get in. Just go back to controlling the ball. That's huge. Absolutely huge. Or it could be. What a pen. He doesn't he doesn't miss pens. I've now cursed him to miss a pen, the most important pen we're ever gonna get, which will be in the next two games. Oh, Palmer's off. Palmer. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. What's wrong with our people not being able to score goals? Someone get some pressure on that ball. Forty seconds to go. There's O'Sullivan. There's Martin. There's Hoare. There's King. He was offside. 
and we're not closing the goal difference gap particularly well today but we did make it and give us the points that we needed okay now Bennett has left dear oh dear there's like an exodus as our players leaving nothing we can do about it free game three days and then we've got um Ely to play and then we've got a bit of a rest which is good news because we need it uh, after the two games in a row we are at home which is good um, let's just have a little look here our games Ely, Wivenhoe and Fetford uh, so Ely are fourth Wivenhoe are sixth and Fetford are eleventh not easy and schedule Ely, oh, that was us. <laughs> Newmarket, where are you? Um, schedule. Goulston, God Manchester, and Long Melford. Um, Goulston, oh dear. Long Melford, oh dear. And God Manchester, oh well. Okay, three teams right at the bottom of the table uh, versus versus us. I guess the only plus point is we've got teams that aren't necessarily paying, playing for anything, whereas they... Uh, they clearly have teams who are fighting for survival, so we might might get a bit fortunate there. Probably not, but you know we're gonna have to just do our very best. Okay. All right, here we go. Big game. You know what? Let's give Mitford a game. Let's get Palmer on the bench. We're going to let Mitford try. Um, how's everybody else? Looking a bit tired, but you know what? We just need to go and play. Simple as that. Okay, here we go. We'll be keeping an eye on the uh, new market score, but I'm not expecting huge things. But there's always twists and turns, so you never know. Here comes a twist. Good save, keeps. Well, Sambu's fouled. Almost a goal down straight away. O'Sullivan, to Howard, to King, to Mitford, Sambu. Oh, it's good football. It's a goal. We are a goal up. That makes a massive difference in the title challenge. However, 11 minutes have gone. Things will still change. There's questions as to whether he was offside, I would suggest, but we won't matter about that. 11-11. Time of the goal. Okay, throw in. Mitford. O'Sullivan. Mitford again. Martin. Howard. Oh, he's hit the post. Sambu picks up a booking. Still nil nil at Newmarket. Half an hour gone. Is Sambu to Hoare to O'Sullivan. We need more goals. Howard to Martin to Hoare to Mitford. It's a long, deep ball. There's another goal. Get in. 2 0 up. It's still 0 0. At this moment in time, we're closing a little bit of a gap on the goal difference, but I mean, I'm not sure it's going to come to that, but we need to put ourselves in the best position possible. Newmarket have just scored, which is bad news. Newmarket have just scored twice, which is extra bad news. Because <laughs> what? no matter what we've done here, they're matching, and that's all they need to do. Come on, Galston. Don't let us down. 
get something from this game. That being said, we're playing some good football. I will say that. Finally, we're playing some good football. But it's all going to be in vain unless, unless they slip up. It doesn't look like slipping up this game. Okay. We'll make some changes here. There we go. Okay, 65 minutes gone. 2 1. Come on, Galston. 20 minutes. We need you to get anything from that game if you can. Still 2 1. Palmer. Oh, he's hit the bar. Cleared away. Last four or five minutes. Are we going to see them get anything? Golston, come on. Come on, Golston. Big push right now. Not looking likely. Last few seconds. And there's the end of the game and they did win 2-1. Disappointing. But we did close a little bit of the goal difference. We still need to get eight goals swing to... Uh, to be the ones to go up if we match points. Uh, next up, Wivenhoe. Okay, let's keep going. Wivenhoe at home. Uh, Bennett has left. Um, he signed for someone. I'm not worried about that. We're just going to push on to Wivenhoe, play that game, and then see where we are at the end of it. That's all we can do. Um, okay. The penultimate game of the season. Can't believe we've let it come to this. We were we were in control of this. We had this in our own hands, and we threw everything away. God damn it. Okay. Here we go. Last three days and then we're playing them. I really, really am not looking forward to another season in this league. Okay. Here we go. This and then Fetford. Sixth and then tenth. We are favourites. Are still level on points. They haven't played there any any of their games, so it's going to be the same. Same here as it is there. We're going to be watching their game whilst we're watching ours. Another offer for one of our players. Which is bad news. Okay, I think we've got the same team. The only thing that I think changed was the bench. Here we go. Okay. Off we go. New marker at home again. As a we. Again, just remember they're playing one of the teams very near the bottom of the table. You'd expect this to be a straightforward thing, but we always struggle with teams at the bottom. Maybe, maybe they will as well. Uh, 12 minutes gone. Nothing happened, really. Here comes a free kick, though. We've won it. Can we find a ball out? We cannot. Oh, maybe we can. We cannot. <laughs> Howard finds Hoare out to King. And there's a red card. That's going to help a little bit, you'd, you'd hope. 
but we've struggled against teams with 10 men before. 20 minutes gone. Sambu's picked up a booking. Half an hour gone. Newmarket have had a player sent off. 40 minutes gone. We haven't created a single chance. Come on, boys. I think we have to do that. Free kick. How to take? Swung in. Oh, we couldn't get anything on it. Great Yama for winning means they're leapfrogging us at this moment in time. Come on, boys. Howard, Sambu, Hoare. Out to O'Sullivan. Martin, back to O'Sullivan. Back to Sambu. King. Ball across. Martin, O'Sullivan. Martin again. Get in. Hoare has scored. I think that's his first goal of the season for us. And it's massive. However, at the very same time, Newmarket have taken the lead with a goal from the penalty spot. That's devastating news. And they've doubled that lead. Five minutes later. God damn it. God, Manchester, you're so letting me down. Come on. Three nil for them. This is coming down if we win to the last game of the season. Looks like we have one, but it looks like it's coming down to a straight out. Whoever gets the best result goes up. Oh dear, oh dear. Well, comes down to this, everybody. Comes down to this. We're against Fetford. I think it's away. All we have to do is beat their result. But it's in their hands. If they win, job done. Okay, here we go. Here we go, everybody. Okay, so we've got a few days rest and then our season comes to a close. Um, I'd love for you guys to let me know once we know how this plays out, how you think the season went, where we could have done better, where we could have uh, where we could have changed it if we don't go up, what we did well if we uh, if we do, if there should be a change to formation. Uh, Fetford of interest and made an offer for our, our player. Um, Everton have been relegated. That's big. Very big. There's a question for you. If Everton offer us the job, are we taking it? Um, okay. Two days to go until the last game of the season. We've already held a team meeting. We don't need another one. Um, okay. Fetford away. in our hands it's not in our hands that's a lie it's out of our hands but a win a win is all we can go for let's go if it's starting up top again and it comes down to this here we go All or nothing right now. We've lost the ball straight from the kickoff. They're in straight from the kickoff. Thankfully, we've won it back. They're away to Long Melford. We're away to Fetford. They're 2 0 up within seven minutes. Game over, everybody. Game over. Well, another season in this league. That's so disappointing. Ball across. We've hit the post. Come on, Long Melford. You can do this. 
Offer me something, Long Melford. Come on. Sambu picks up a book in. We need to figure out something to do with our our team, our players. They're all out of contract. Well, they haven't really got contracts, but they're all free to leave at the end of the season. I get the feeling at this rate we're going to have a whole new team. Avia finds King. Ball across. Should have been a goal. Not even entirely sure what that was, Mitford. Um, 40 minutes to go. Five minutes until half time. Doesn't look like we're going to get anything from from Long Melford in the first half. It can change though. Two goals in a half is more than doable. It can definitely change. There's a first goal from uh, Long Melford. We need something. What have we got? Because at this moment in time, we're not doing a lot. Here we go. Come on, boys. They're attacking. That's not good. Sullivan to Hoare. O'Sullivan. Hoof down the field. Youngs is chasing. He's not going to get there. And here they come. Wouldn't be surprised if Long Melford equal it up and we don't we don't beat their result. That's the kind of thing that we do. Well hell keeps. Three one new market. Game over there. We're still drawing. There goes Youngs. Still can't score for us. Here comes the corner from Ward. Another corner. Well, Sullivan is going to get there, slowly. 20 minutes to go. Twenty minutes to go and we've created nothing. Apart from that one, one on one, which we should have done better with. We might have had someone sent off though. Not that it's going to make any odds. We need a goal. 10 minutes to go. Hall's in. Hall scored. All eyes on Long Melford. Need two goals. Against 10 men, they are at home. I don't see it though. Goes Ward. O'Sullivan's made the burst forward. King's there. Good goal. Two goals in two minutes at Long Melford is what we need. Don't see it. Good finish. Not sure about the first touch, but a good finish. Last 45 seconds of this game. And we done what we needed to do. Unfortunately, Long Melford couldn't help us out. And there we go. So disappointing. Well, well, well. Don't really know what to say. We uh, we stay here, they go up. We paid out eight hundred and fifty pounds as a squad bonus. I could have made that higher, I guess, since I didn't have to pay anyone. Um, 
Sambu's left. Our second is the highest position we've ever finished. And uh, well, there we go. So disappointing. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, please hit the like button, subscribe button. Let us know what you think of the first season. Um, and uh, I guess we'll see you again soon. Thank you. What you gonna do? We're doing it all.